Hello folks, here I go again with another beautiful 2012 Dodge Charger 5.7 Hemi Police Pursuit Vehicle from the city of Los Alamitos, California. That is a uh, private uh, police department. Vehicle does have 111,000 miles with only 750 idle hours. This vehicle was a commander's unit. It was never on patrol. And I'm sure she was just going up and down the highway to and from work. The vehicle has been completely serviced, detailed, and it doesn't need any repairs whatsoever as I already have taken care of everything. Folks, the vehicle is like a, a greenish color, green silver in color. It almost looks gun metal gray. I do apologize, I do not know the right uh, paint code or terminology for this particular paint job, but it is the original paint job. It does have very little tiny scratches. Some are noticeable and some are not. Stay with me and I will go ahead and point those out to you as I make my way around the vehicle. Before I forget, vehicle does have tinted windows, dark shade in the rear, medium in the front. This is how the car came to me. So I decided to leave that alone. And you know what, it's actually a nice color combo right there. No holes on the body whatsoever. Folks, this vehicle is in immaculate running condition and shape. If you are in the market for a Dodge Charger 5.7 Hemi, folks, please look no further. This is it, you are looking at it. Folks, before I forget, I must tell you that the vehicle does have four good year Eagles RSA tires. The ones that the car came with when I got it at the auction, they were down to 30%. They were a little bit dry. They were not acceptable, so I went ahead and gave you four set of um, Goodyear RSA Eagles. They are good uh, semi. They are good takeoff tires, 90% thread or so. New conditions, pretty much. Also, before I forget, and I should mention this when I'm under the hood, but the vehicle also does have a uh, new front brakes and rotors. You can kind of see that through there. New front brakes and rotors by Posse Quiets. Let me go back here, show you the rear. I do apologize. All right, here you go. New rear brakes and rotors by Posse Quiets 105 series. I don't like noise, so yes, I do pay the price for the uh, better quality iron and formula padding for those brakes. Clear lights and lessons in the front. Nice chrome grill. Fog lights, uh, those are factory fog lights. They do work and uh, we'll get to those uh, when we get there. Folks, uh, I do have uh, some scratches here. You can kind of see them there on the roof. Let me backtrack. I do have some type of stain right here. My detail guy couldn't get that off. It looks like it's under the paint. I don't know what it is, but it's there. Scratches here, here, a little paint peeling here, and here. One small little door ding right here. Once again, folks, the door ding, it's not really noticeable, but it's there. I like to be very transparent with my customers and let you know everything I see behind the camera. Okay, so scratches there. Passing your side of the vehicle, it's intact. No door dings, not one scratch. Everything was here. All right, let's continue. Let's go inside. 
Folks, as you guys can see, I do have a uh, perfect matching interior. All seat belts and buckles are in place. Carpeting floors. I do have a new set of original equipment floor mats. When I got the car, there were no floor mats. As you guys know, they do rip those off at the auction. Door rods inside the car. Switches do work, okay? Complete. So if you have passengers in the back seat, yes, they'll be able, they will be able to get out of the car. I do have a, a brand new original equipment master switch. The old one, let me clean this up here, was broken. For those of you that are familiar with Mopar products, this button always breaks. So there, you got a new one. Once again, new floor mats folks I don't play around driver's seat perfect nice and comfortable passing your side seat I don't think nobody ever sat there stay with me I'm inside the vehicle now folks very obvious sorry I'm being funny today perfect dash no holes on the vehicle whatsoever cruise control does work honk works I do have the uh, Bluetooth option here. You can, let me clean this up here for you guys. Bluetooth option is, it's available for this car, okay? Before I forget, I did uh, two, two minor things that I left pending. I didn't notice that this, uh, I was missing a cigarette lighter that goes inside the center console. The plug is here, so don't worry guys. I'm gonna order one on eBay and have it installed. Let's go ahead and fire her up. And the second little detail that I'm missing is that one of my tire sensors is bad. So you're gonna see the light come up for the uh, TPS sensor. Don't worry, oil change was done already. I forgot to reset it, but it was done, guys. Uh, once again, TPS sensor uh, is blinking because I am one of my sensors or two of my sensors are bad. I did order two already on eBay and they are making the way in. Once again, cigarette lighter, TPS sensors, and disregard the oil change light. I keep forgetting to reset it, but yes, it was done. Stereo does work. Stereo does work. For those of you that are not familiar with the screen, it is a touch screen. So you can, you can change it by just tapping on it and so is the climate control, okay? Uh, everything does work. Courtesy lights, courtesy lights do work. They do come on every time you uh, open the doors on the vehicle. Let's get to the trunk real quick. I need to step it up because the clock is ticking. So bear with me guys, holy moly, eight minutes already. Woo, I'm getting entertained here. Perfect. Um, trunk liner and trunk space I do have a, a brand new matching uh, correction brand new donut brand new battery folks yes when I first got the car <laughs> he had a uh, quite a few little things that I found and one of those was the battery dead battery so that is a new battery rest assured it is a new battery for those of you that track my work follow me you guys know I don't like to cut any corners whatsoever and I do pay the price to get things done the right way. Before I forget, those uh, center chrome caps, those are completely new along with the lug nuts, especially made for the police pursuit vehicle. Once again, that is a dealer item only. I couldn't find those used, so they're all new. That's $500 right there for the set. Four hook caps and 20 lug nuts in order to have those center cups, uh, center cup, uh, cups fit. Let me hurry up here guys. Once again, my detail crew went through the whole car and they left nothing for you to do, okay? Everything has been done, everything has been addressed. And folks, once again, I set you up for success. It's starting right to left, brand new air filter. I do have 16 Motocraft Platinum Iradium plugs, transmission service was done with ATF 4, Mopar fluid and filter, super cold air conditioner, 
I do have a brand new alternator. Remember when I said the battery is new? Well, charging system was acting up. The alternator kept coming, kept coming on and off. So I do have a brand new alternator with a brand new battery. For those car guys, we all know that when you replace the alternator, you gotta replace the battery, okay? Fresh, full synthetic, 520, seven quarts, oil change and filter. Let me see, am I forgetting anything else? Throttle body was serviced and cleaned out. Water pump appears to be new from that department, so does the uh, dry belt and tensioner. All right. Folks, this vehicle is in immaculate running condition and shape. She is already. She's ready to go anywhere. Am I forgetting anything? Let me think. Hmm. I hope not. If I do forget something, it's probably gonna be in my eBay ad. New tires, new hug cup, lug nuts, uh, new battery alternator, floor mats. Da, 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 da. I do have the TPS sensors coming in and I gotta order a cigarette lighter for us so that the vehicle can be 110% complete. One last final look guys, as the clock is ticking and I'm pushing the envelope here. Sometimes I do have a lot of ground to cover and I like to let you guys know everything that was done to my car Before she sells all right folks once again. This is the Grand Victoria guy signing off uh, Folks, I gotta go. I'd like to thank you for your time your patience here watching this video uh, Once again, you guys have a uh, blessed week. Thank you and take care